yo what's going on guys welcome back to another awesome video and in today's video guys i will be teaching you five of the best farms to build in lifeboat skyblock this farm has been incinerated by mobs but it is potentially a potato farm and potato farms is good when you start out because uh, it sells the same as diamonds now you can either have potato or carrot farms whichever suits you the best and it's also a food source so it's like a two-in-one so if you uh, smelt some items and then eventually take uh, one or two items out of a uh, furnace or smelter or whatever it actually gives you XP so yeah and uh, also another good farm for when you are starting out is sugarcane because sugarcane grows really fast and yeah it's it's something that I started with when I didn't have money um, tree farms is also very good it doesn't make a lot of money but it's so it, it, it saves you when you do not have wood and as you know you need wood for all of the things that you might build now next up is a farm uh, iron golden farm or any mob farm now you guys will see this farm that I have uh, what that that is a one creepy golem anyways this form that I have supports all types of mobs uh, I would suggest that you make it bigger than I did but don't use water at the bottom because uh, the water just messes with the mobs AI so killing them with lava and then having hoppers all the way you don't have to put the chest there, but I, I just put it there in case the mob farm starts uh, clogging up. Which means it won't clog up. And uh, you can hook it up to an auto salt chest. If you don't, then uh, hook all of these up to a chest system. If you can afford it, make yourself a auto smelter uh, for your food. Then you can just put in raw food. Uh, so that you and your mini miners are always fed and then uh, we've got the cactus farm as well now one good thing about cactus farms is you never have to attend to it only if you want to expand it now uh, as you guys will see the way that I built this uh, is different than the old one because the new farms are not stackable so I leave a space between them uh, so that they can flow and I make sure that all of the the water goes into the middle almost like the old type of uh, mob farms uh, this way the the cactus does not get stuck or the water does not glitch out so yeah that is uh, there is a few farms that you guys can use and i uh, hope this video helps you guys out and if you guys uh, want to see my collection system then stay tuned now over here i've got uh, three hoppers in each direction and one in the middle which all leads down to one auto cell chest but you can add more auto cell chests and add more collection systems to make your selling of your cactus faster depending on how big your cactus farm is now one thing i would suggest though is to buy vip if you have not got vip if you want to build big farms like that uh cactus farm especially because you get hurt by standing on cactus now if you look at my miners you see i put them in a crisscross type of cross uh pattern and this is because this makes the farm much faster um, and i also have two ender chests hooked to it so as you guys can see the hoppers run two times there's two rows of hoppers running into ender chest one at the bottom and one at the top so yeah that is that is it and then one more tip i can give you guys is to 
fly around on your island and see where you earn the most coins. One thing I can suggest is to always uh, build an AFK pool so that the game does not kick you from the game. If you want to earn more, make sure you're on a server that's not uh, full like this one is um, at the moment. So if you do at, you can see there's quite a few people on the server. You generally want the server where only you or one of your friends is online. That way the server dedicates more space to you and therefore you start earning more coins. Now the best servers to go to is ones other than SB1, SBS1. Now if you want to transfer to it you can only be in the lobby. You can only do this in the lobby then you do transfer and for example SBS2 or free or any number up to 28 i think so you you will see if i try to transfer to sbs you can it will say you this cannot command in this mode like that and that means you need to be in lifeboat's main lobby to transfer otherwise you can just use the book and open world games and then go to skyblock 2.0 which is the current beta of skyblock so yeah i hope this video uh wasn't too long guys and i hope it helped out uh quite a bit and if it did uh let me know in the comments saying thank you or cool video or something like that and yeah uh i will start posting more videos more often guys so if you guys have any request of a full-on tutorial on how to build these farms uh, i will do so i hope this gave you some inspiration of what to do or gave you a general idea and like i said don't feel afraid to ask me to build a farm uh, from scratch again to show you guys every single detail because i will definitely do that but other than that guys Stay safe, stay well, and I'll see you guys.